Welcome to another Marksmanship Masterclass, where you can get the information knowledge you need to take your shooting experience and your firearms to the red zone. I'm Advanced Weapons Instructor David Watson, and the topic of today's Masterclass is rifle barrels. Modern rifle barrels are normally made from 4140 chromoly steel or 416 stainless steel. To make a barrel, a billet or rod of steel is taken, and using precision deep hole drilling equipment, the bore is made. The rifling is created by either drawing a forming button through the tube or by a process known as hammer forging. The barrel is then known as a blank. This blank is then lathe turned to develop the profile or external shape and form features on the barrel like the reinforce at the chamber end and the fittings and bosses at the muzzle end. Barrels are defined and chosen and differ on their specifications of twist rate, length, style of rifling and exterior profile. These specifications can be fine-tuned to achieve superior performance for a chosen calibre or specific firearm usage, and we'll discuss that in the next video. When looking at a rifle barrel, either before you shoot or perhaps in assessing a second-hand rifle for purchase, we need to look specifically at certain features that can tell us what kind of condition that barrel is in. To start with though, always clean the bore first and there's a great video on how to do that on the Marksmanship Masterclass channel. First, look at the crown, where the rifling finishes at the end of the barrel. Look for chips, gouges, uneven wear, or anything that does not look quite like a defined transition from crown to muzzle. Also look for streaks of copper in the last inch or so of the rifling that may indicate poor cleaning. Next, look at the throat where the chamber finishes and the rifling starts, looking for wear on hard edges, erosion, pitting, and uneven point damage. The throat should look clean and defined in the machine transition from the smooth neck of the chamber to the rifling ramps that lead into the bore. Finally, look at the rifling through its length. Look for wear on hard edges, pitting, concentric rings in the bore, and point damage to the lands and grooves. It's important to note that a well cared for and evenly worn barrel will still shoot very, very well. A damaged or unevenly worn and poorly cared for barrel will shoot unpredictably. If you want more information on barrels or any other topic discussed in these videos, be sure to click on the link below to my books on Amazon, both in hard copy and digital formats. If you appreciated the information in this video, you can show your appreciation right now by clicking on the PayPal button below and donate any amount you feel is equal to the value of the information in this video. Don't forget to click on subscribe and stay tuned for more videos from Marksmanship Masterclass.